Hello everybody, welcome to a short tutorial video on OpenCV in Python. In this tutorial, I would like to show to you how to draw a triangle on the image using OpenCV. Uh, by default, the OpenCV doesn't have uh, the built-in function to build a triangle on the image. So as you may be seen in my previous video that we can draw a rectangle as well as circle on the image using the built-in function from the OpenCV. So here we will use the cv2.polyline method which is basically a function to draw a line on the image but we can use this function to draw a triangle on the image. So first let us import the OpenCV library and here we also need the NumPy library to draw this triangle. Okay, next we open our image here using the cv 2imread function. So let I show this uh, input image to you. So this is the input image or the image that we will draw a triangle. So here we need to define the vertices or the corner point of our triangle. So triangle has a three point. This is will be the first point at the bottom left and the second point here will be the point on the bottom right. And this is will be the point on the middle top of the triangle. And make sure to set the data type as an integer. Okay, let's run this code. And let's we check it safe. The shape of this vertices variable is 3 by 2 but if we would like to use these vertices as an input to draw a triangle using the cv2.polyline we need to change this shape. So here we use the vertices.resave we change the shape from 3 by 2 into 3 by 1 and by 2 which is the 3 dimension matrix. Okay, let's we check here. Okay, so now our uh, points has a shape is uh, three dimension array, which is three by one and by two. Next, we use the cv2 dot polylines with a method to draw the line. Here, the in the first input here is the image variable, and the second input here is the list of the points or the vertices. So the third input here is the color. Here the color is in blue, green, and red channel because I will display this result using the CV2 that I'm show. So this one will return as the red color. And the fourth variable here is close, is basically a flag. So uh, let's first we set here as true. And then the last argument here is the thickness of the line. Okay, let's run this one. And let's we show the result using the CV2 that I show. All right. So here I draw a triangle on the this Rubik image using the CV2 dot polylines method. So the point 10 and 500 is here, and the 210 and 500 in this corner, and 100 by 10 is in here. So here, this is basically the X and Y location of the point. So remember here we set the is close variable as true and what happens if we set this is close variable as as false? Alright, so here I change the is close variable as a false. First let's we reopen our image and then we draw the triangle and let's see the result. Alright, so as you can see here that we lose or we don't have the line from this point into this point. So basically it's close here. Tell the CV to the polyline to draw line back from the last point to the first point. So if you tell this is close as a true or set this is close variable as a true, then the polyline will draw a line back from the last point to the first point. But if you set this is close as a false, then uh, this polyline will not draw a line back from the last corner to the first corner. Okay, 
that's all from this video i hope you learned something useful thank you for watching and see you on the next video